Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel and welcome to Vlogmas Day 14. If you're new here, I'm Anna Nicole and as you can tell by the title, today's video will be a full Christmas list, a full list of ideas that you can get someone for Christmas, also things that I would like for Christmas. So if that's something you're interested in, if that's something you need help with as we get closer to this holiday season, definitely stay tuned and let's get into the video. So like I said, I have a full list of items that you could get someone for Christmas or that you could put on your own wish list. And some of them are a little more pricey than the others, but yeah, just get what you feel comfortable with or ask for what you feel comfortable asking for. And yeah, let's just jump into the video. So the very first thing that you cannot go wrong with is a sweatsuit set. So I love these. I talk about these all the time, the matching top and the bottoms. And you honestly cannot go wrong with getting just a solid color because everybody loves solid colors. But at one point the tie dye was in, I wouldn't go that route this year just because, like I've mentioned on my channel before, tie-dye is not really in right now, but you cannot go wrong with like a solid color, like a burnt orange, or just like if the person wears like brighter colors, then you could get like a neutral, brighter color. So you can't go wrong with that. Those are so cute and they are actually not too expensive. You also can't go wrong with a puffer jacket. Puffer jackets are in right now, especially the cropped puffer jackets, but also the long puffer jackets, leather jackets. Um, leather is just in in general so also a lot of people are into coffee and a great gift for them would be matcha or like the coffee cups because that's just something that people don't typically think about and that's just an easy also cheaper gift also a lot of people are into at-home workouts right now so you cannot go wrong with a yoga mat or just a workout set like the um, matching crop top and bottom again you cannot go wrong with solid neutral looking colors those look great on everyone instead of just doing crazy patterns and you don't know if they like it or not you cannot go wrong with just a solid neutral color airpods airpods are a bit pricier but they are really nice or if you don't want to get airpods you could definitely just get the wireless headphones and those are just as cute in my opinion um an ipad Honestly, this iPad literally, I don't know what I was doing before I had this iPad. Anyone could use an iPad because you can do literally everything on an iPad. So an iPad is an amazing gift. An iPad pencil is an even more amazing gift. I want an iPad pencil, but I really do not want to buy that for myself. And I just want someone else to buy it for me. Um, you can do so much with an iPad pencil. Not only like if they edit YouTube videos, they can write on the screen with the iPad pencil if they are a graphic designer or go on, or they doodle or anything. You can do that with an iPad pencil and it's so convenient. I would love an iPad pencil. An Apple Watch is another good gift. Or if the person already has an Apple Watch, you can get them some new Apple Watch bands. That's another cheaper option for that gift. Blue light glasses. Everyone is on their screens all the time. Blue light glasses are a must. I have a pair of blue light glasses. You can find them pretty much anywhere at this point because everyone has some type of screen that they look at. So blue light glasses is a great gift. A new phone case, that's something that people typically don't want to buy themselves. Apple AirTag, I mentioned this one in my video like this last year. This is a really, really good gift. I don't, I can't tell you how many times I've said, where is my wallet? But like, if you have the Apple AirTag, you can put that in your wallet or, or just anything that you just continue to lose, like your keys and you can track it down with your iPhone. So that is a really, really good gift. Um, a juicer, a lot of people have, are on a health kick and especially going into the new years, people typically hop onto a health kick, a health bandwagon, just to try to restart the new year and pick up new habits. So you can encourage those new habits by getting someone a juicer, which again is another pricier gift, but it's still a really good gift. Crest teeth whitening strips, those are so expensive and no one wants to buy those, but that is a really good gift. A 2022 planner. I feel like a lot more people are still trying to get into a routine after 2020. And so a 2022 planner would be so amazing to help people get organized and stay organized. And it's also, who doesn't like a planner? So a planner and some pens will be a really good gift as well. Self-help books and or just books in general. I feel like after 2020, a lot more people got into reading. So if you know someone who loves to read and you know good books or just self-help books that they might like, that's a really good gift. Canvases and paints. Um, I love to paint. I don't know where that came from or <laughs> how that started recently, but I love canvases and paint. So I would love 
new canvases if someone wanted to give me that. But also a diffuser and oils. So the oils for diffusers can be pretty pricey, so that's a really good gift, especially if they already have a diffuser, you could just get them the oils, or you could get them the entire kit, which is the diffuser and the oils. But yeah, I have a diffuser over there on the corner, and I would love some oils to go with my diffuser. LED strip lights, those are really popular right now. Candles, you cannot go wrong with a candle. Bath & Body Works has really amazing candles that smell so good, and also, I mean, but you could also just find candles in like Walmart, so <laughs> that's a really easy gift. Shower gels, face masks, silk pillowcases are an amazing gift, not just because silk pillowcases are good for your hair, but also just because it's also good for your face, and they're just, I don't know, they're just a lot better. But also throw pillows. Everybody loves throw pillows. You could get like the really minimal ones, just plain white or just, you know, a plain color that you feel like might look good in their room or might look good to them. And that's a really good gift too. Blankets. Everybody loves blankets as well as socks. You cannot go wrong with socks. My favorite socks are the fluffy, fuzzy ones because they're so comfortable to walk around in. And I also love, I've loved, I've been loving the higher ones recently just to lounge around in. They're so comfortable. Ugg slippers. I saw a pair of these in the store and I really want them. I personally really want them. Um, they are so cute and they're in right now. They're trending right now. These would be another example of a pricier gift, but you could definitely find them. Some dupes for cheaper and Again, who doesn't love slippers, so. A Bluetooth speaker that's also waterproof. Also, Ariana Grande just dropped her makeup line, Rim Beauty, so anything from that would be on trend, on time, and perfect. Eyelash primer, that is something I feel like everyone needs. Let me tell you, it works wonders. It makes your eyelashes look so much longer. So for the people who do not wear like lash extensions and stuff like that, eyelash primer will definitely come in handy for them. You can't go wrong with makeup brushes, beauty blenders, those are easy stocking stuffers or just gifts in general. Urban Decay All Nighter. I think we can all agree that is the best setting spray. A mini purse in our wallet. So whenever I go out, I like to have just my mini purse. Actually, I can show you. Whenever I go out, I like to have my mini purse just because this is so much easier to carry around than like a big purse would be. So this would be an amazing gift. A Polaroid camera or film. I have a Polaroid camera. I would love some film if anyone wants to get me some film <laughs> because that is actually pretty pricey and I love my Polaroid camera. Like I use it all the time. So I use a film really quickly. The price adds up. But also along with that, pe some people actually prefer the disposable cameras and the, um, I guess the, the tape, the roll tape that goes with that. So you can't go wrong there either. Curly hair products because curly hair products are super expensive. So if you know a curly girl, help a curly girl out this <laughs> Christmas and get them some curly hair products. Hair care items like silk scrunchies, a diffuser, wide tooth combs, especially again, if they're a curly hair girl, can't go wrong with why too calm. Baseball caps. I've been into baseball caps recently and I think they add so much to like just an outfit. And I think baseball caps are actually just genuinely in right now. They add so much to an outfit. They can, they just make your outfit look better. Sports gear. So I've been going to a lot of games recently as well. I would love to have a jersey for my home team. Um, I'm a Panthers fan. So I would love like a Panthers jersey or something like that. Um, an oversized Panthers jersey would be nice. Also when it comes to shoes, you cannot go wrong with Jordan 1s, Air Forces, Doc Martens, and then also for anyone who is of age, wine would be a good gift. A spa day gift card, a gift card to a food location, tickets to a concert or a game would be an amazing gift. Sephora and or Ulta gift card, another good gift, especially if you don't feel like actually going in and looking for the items that you think they might like. You can just give them a gift card and they can pick it out themselves. And trust me, they would be so thankful. New luggage for anyone who likes to travel. I definitely need some new luggage. I want the um, hard plastic luggage right now i have the cloth one and i do not like that so i definitely need some new luggage and i would love that also last but not least the honestly the sweetest gift i feel like would be anything personalized so something with the person's name on it or something like with their initials or just like an insider or just words of encouragement that you actually it shows you actually put in the effort for the gift and Anybody would love that. So <laughs> you can't go wrong with getting something personalized for that person. So yeah, that concludes this video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you all right back here tomorrow with another video. Bye guys.